Also, do I sound fine? You yeah. sound wow. fine. That voice is chocolatey, smooth. I am melting as we speak. Okay. Then, all right. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Sorry, is there something wrong with my compliment? No. Yeah. <laughs> A no. little bit. <laughs> it's just on the creepy side as far as compliments go. Oh. Well, I'll just kill myself. What? Oh. <laughs> I'm kidding. Hold on, hold on. Give me the password to your computer so I can give someone else the note for the session. God. <laughs> Eight years and that's all I mean to you. <laughs> I don't know. I'll be sad while typing it in. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, that is probably one of the most hurtful things you've ever said to me. Wow, I've I missed these these sketches that Jade has put up. They're so cute. Yeah, they are. Yeah, oh, Eddie's trying to break my heart with uh, that, and then Jade's trying to blow my arteries with cute. I can't believe we got turned into marketable plushies. <laughs> of course we did. We're very marketable. <laughs> They're gonna be up on Etsy by next month. Oh, They're God. easy to draw. Word. <laughs> You're surely I'm you down for that. No one higher acts. We should, surely you're we should not try and to market this plushies. campaign. No one's watching. <laughs> <laughs> yes. What? Hey, at least two people watch every video. For yeah, like eight cute. minutes. <laughs> I, I don't even know who actually watches and the videos. Just... They're just hunting for more wing things to sell. See, you say that, but then... You say that, but there's, like, more than five views on each video. Sometimes there's ten. Let's just double dips. Thanks, Ed. Really helping my confidence today. It doesn't work like that. I don't know why you're taking anything I say seriously. I don't know. I take everything you say seriously, remember? You... You should know, after eight you? years, that is like the dumbest thing you can do in every sense except for financially. Eddie, a, a few points. Um, One, but I love you. Two, uh, have I been known to make good re decisions? Yes. Okay, about relationships of any variety. Yes. Are you sure? Yeah. We're here, aren't we? Well, uh, look, I don't lawyer. trust any of you. You, you brought the uh, you. I trust Shay. I trust Shay. The uh, oh, you. Yeah. Hold up. Hold up. I trust you too. Every, everyone trusts Shay because Shay huh? just says whatever the hell's on her mind. Yes. Exactly. Yes. But but before you claim lawyer. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Before you claim uh, lawyer. You expect. Me do you really say that I am here scheming? Yeah. Every single day of your fucking life. <laughs> and that proves it. Lawyered! I've never schemed a day in my life. Well, you about to. Where's that recap music? Oh. Oh yeah, I'm a DJ. Hold on. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. I am a DJ. I like to make music. <laughs> Speaking of recap, I got this really weird. I got this really weird DM last night, and it's kind of funny. Uh, dungeon master or direct message? Direct message. <laughs> okay. Uh, department of motor. <laughs> I'm going to hurt you. <laughs> we are going to beat you to death. Ha, uh, do it. I need a, I'm going to wax the fucking hair off your tits. How about that? Somebody, uh, somebody sent this to You're me last jealous. night. I am not jealous of titty hair. That gross. No offense. Yeah. I hate that term. I've never heard that before, and I don't like it now. It is. Uh, right, it is a true see. thing. What is this oh, message? Right. I don't know. So I've never heard this. Me I've never heard of this guy before, and Smiler. never talked to him. He just sent it to me ra randomly, and it was pretty oh, yeah. funny. That's and then I blocked him. Yeah. Huh? Um, so hold Is that on. one of those scrub up. quotes I hear about? It, uh, yeah. People were saying it was an LTG quote. Oh. <laughs> it might be. It looks like it. So, so by definition, yes. Yeah, a scrub, a quote from the scrub. All right. Let me, let me, let me pull up. Pull up thing. All right. Well, you pull up that. I'm going to let. Hold 
up. You guys do your thing. I'll be right back. Pull up with that motherfucking thing. Hello? 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 Uh, you, have a you got the, he got the motherfucking Etrian Odyssey Blicky. Oh. Gotcha. Yeah. Right, um. It stresses me out that the turn order popped back up on old twenty. <laughs> can you X? Oh, you can. Yeah. <laughs> oh. What happened? Not up to us. I'll be right back too. Right. Right. Gonna get some munchie. Again. Well, while that yeah. happens, okay. I might as well hit that recap. So, where we last left our adventurers, the brave Pringucci Velatus was too owl bared up on a midsummer's night. <laughs> the young. Are you a wizard or a sorceress? What the hell is Nim? Help me. A sorcerer. Sorceress Nim was around the campfire with her bestest of buddies, Hyala and Samosin. Because I imagine everybody's a friend to Nim. Well, Nim thinks everybody's her friend. <laughs> okay, friend no, here. Nim thinks everybody in the group is cool. Well, let me be correct. That's, that's true, I think. Yeah. Let me stop it right there. You bitch. <laughs> Prince just like, I'm not cool. <laughs> As he just falls back between the owl's bears. Uh, Celeste, we, uh, Celeste was getting her head cut mauled by the owl bear's armpit. Otherwise, no, sleeping on one. Otherwise yeah. known as Betsy Lee's pit. Um, and y'all were doing something about your night watch, which I... Honestly, didn't bother to remember because I figured you I all remember. had a hand I went on that. last. The rest of it was too confusing. So, so it's uh, Nim, then me, and then Celeste for the rest of the night. Sure. Uh, hello. What? What happened? What's going on? Who's destroying? Somebody him? is destroying a bag of chips. You That's me. Rebel. Bruh. All right. Yeah. Show. Guys, check this out. Are you blowing up a balloon animal? Make sure to stay hydrated. Oh my god. Alright. Uh, hydrate or dihydrate. Okay. I don't know what that means. Anyway. <laughs> no, they don't sleep. They can't drink. Well, doesn't mean their mind can't wander. So. I mean, they could daydream, I guess, but it's not. We left off with everybody except Nim sleeping. Mm hmm. Nim drew a map. They were. You did draw a map. Yeah. Of our current progress, so it's not that big. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Oof. Who the fuck is that? That was just Sansa Bar off in the distance. Don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> a nice map there. Ha ha ha! Nice map. My headphone is pretty. My headphone's pretty close to the mic. Oopsie. So, does anything happen on Nim's know. watch? Uh, no, not really. Excellent. Okay, so those birds. Oh, what they do. Yeah. Well, good question. So there's just three birds uh, hovering around the fire. Almost forgot that was included with something. I'm sleep sleep. Yeah. Uh, like, how close are we talking to the fire? Uh, not close enough to be burned, but they're still observing the fire, I'm tweeting, chirping, and chittering around it as they kind of just hover float in a circle. Oh. Nim says hi. Uh, one of the birds looks back at you and then flies up to you and starts uh, uh, doing a thing. Give sec. What? Doing a thing what? means that the bird does this. Ow. What the 
Perfect. Okay. Uh, Nim asked, how's it doing? <laughs> the bird chatters at you. <laughs> you don't not the long. Option. Not understanding. It's like, that's so interesting. What kind of things have you seen? The bird lands in front of you and proceeds to start tweeting. You don't want to watch <laughs> Make sure to watch sleep. Nim uh, is like, that sounds really fun. Got any stories? I, I, what if the bird had told you, like, well, my dad just died, and you're like, that's <laughs> Well, you see, these are my friends, and, you know, I don't really know my family. They don't let me back in the nest. I wasn't the egg they wanted! <laughs> and that day, Nim yeah. made a friend. <laughs> me too, buddy, me too. Now tell me more about your life. Uh, but, yeah, the bird, uh, seeing you'd mean no harm, now flutters up and sits on your knee. And the other two birds now come over, and they proceed to chirp and chatter. Now you have the attention of three birds. Fantastic. <laughs> uh, Nim asked, do you, do you guys have a name, or should I name you? One of the birds flaps its wings. And then folds them back up. <laughs> I have no idea what that means. It cocks Here its comes. head and it cocks its head to the side and stares at you. Ah. Nim says, I'm gonna take that as a yes, and I'm going to call you Jerry. You like that? You get another chirp. Somebody's stuff is feeding back through their mic. Uh, I will see if it's mine. I don't think so. It's... I hear it too, so it's probably not me. I'm eating cashew. Ah, uh, it's mine. I see mine randomly flickering. That's a good choice, cashews. So, I will turn down my sound a bit. Not that much. Alright, so... Nim asked Jerry, what's your favorite food? <laughs> Human flesh. You double chatter. Yeah, so Nim's like, it's a good food, Jerry. And then Nim asked the other two, so you guys got names or should I name Kramer. you as well? <laughs> One's named George and Kramer. <laughs> Oh god. As you ask that <laughs> As you ask that, another two Patui come out of the forest and no. decide to land on your shoulder. <laughs> oh my god. I I thought just touching them was bad. I'm wearing clothes. Clothing. Uh. Ah. <laughs> Nim says new friends. How's it going? <laughs> a tweet and a chirp. Ooh, oh, chirp. Oh, We're that's mixing spicy. it up. <laughs> ah. hit, him, hit him with the mix up. <laughs> and the previous two birds chatter and tweet. Oh. <laughs> you have. Uh, the okay, only so okay. I'm gonna be real with you. The only three actions these birds have are chirp, chatter, and tweet. <laughs> Other than spit. That's a reaction. What? <laughs> <laughs> so you got five of these birds now. Varying degrees of closeness to your bubble of personal space. This is fine. <laughs> Hold on. Let me double check a thing. Double check if it's fine. <laughs> yeah. Is it fine or should I be playing on a game? Ah, uh, so I could just have Nim grow fur, but that's still on your body. Yeah, well, uh, the the lady said if thick enough fur is fine for them to touch, it just has to be washed thoroughly. We got the decanter, ain't no prob. 
But also, I don't know if suddenly growing fur will freak these birds out. Because I was not expecting there to be more birds. <laughs> mm -hmm. I mean, all it takes is one. Yeah. Uh, okay, so I'm going to be real with you, bruh. I'm just going to keep asking random questions. So, if that's how this goes... <laughs> Nim plays 20 questions with a flock of the world's most poisonous birds. Actually, yes. <laughs> so, add so... like 20 more chirps, chatters, and tweets. <laughs> as, as Nim... As Nim works her way into becoming a Disney princess. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, what do you do next? Five birds. Okay. Uh, did you just hear what I said? Uh, I Maybe I zoned out? Ow. Thanks, Chair. Uh, I'm going to continue to play this game of 20 questions, actually. Okay, proceed. Ah. Uh, you, you want me to act out this game of 20 questions? Yeah! We'll see how far this goes. Okay. Uh, how much time until so Nim has to wake up Samson? Uh, you're going to try and wake up Samson? No, I said how much time until Nim has to wake up Samson. How much time is your shift? Two hours. It's two hours. Alright. Well, there's your answer. But we're not sitting here for two hours acting this out. No, well, yeah, I know. Time. I'm just asking how much time has passed because Nim's already done a thing and now there's birds. Oh, I'd say maybe a uh, half hour. Ugh, that's not a lot of time. Oh, okay. So Nim will be like, You guys got any tricks? Can you, like, hit a backflip? You guys ever been to the circus? <laughs> I hear that's a thing. So, four, four of the birds kind of just tilt to you, and Jerry flies off your knee back into the forest. Oh, not Jerry. Nim says bye, Jerry. <laughs> so, yeah, the rest of the birds are confused. Or quizzical. Right. So, Nim will proceed to explain what a circus is. <laughs> to the birds? Yes. The birds sit with you very pleasantly by the fire, and then you hear the chirping of a familiar bird as you see what you think is Jerry come out, and following him are seven more birds that make their way over to the fire. <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> you know, and just goes well. Now it's a party. You now you have a total is... of twelve birds. Okay, how much time has passed now? A few minutes, <laughs> maybe I less. I feel like it takes longer than a couple minutes to explain what a circus is. <laughs> You'd be surprised how long it take uh, 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 it takes to talk. It's quite quick. This is Nim, though, so Nim went into unnecessary detail. I'm just gonna put some birds around Nim. Oh, gosh. <laughs> They're huge. I can't make them any smaller! They're tiny, but they literally won't go smaller. <laughs> so, okay. yeah. So, Nim's like, now it's a party. This is gonna be really bad when Sans when it sets. Oh happens. yeah, it's super bad. Oh, I don't know how Nim's to gonna go to sleep. <laughs> so yeah, so, you have twelve birds now. I will represent your first five. So do you want to just go forward and warp to when Samson wakes up? Uh yeah. But uh, I'm assuming that getting up is going to be difficult. So I'm going to do this thing called talk to Samson with my mind. Because Nim's telepathic. And she's like, hey, Samson. <laughs> wake up. Are you, waking, are you waking him up early? Or is, that what, is this when he's supposed to get up? 
Yeah, this is the one he's supposed to get up. Ah, good. That requires the Samson. <laughs> so Nim goes, uh... Oh no, don't touch Samson's gun. I'm touching my gun. Who said that? <laughs> Great, you're up, Samson. I made friends. And Nim gestures to all the birds. As, as? Wait, no, 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 no. Hold up, hold up. No, 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 no. So, <laughs> Samson, like, from light, leaning back of, uh, against the owl bear with the hat on his face, sits straight up, still with the hat on his face. <laughs> okay. And here's that Nim made friends and lifts the hat, like, off of his eyes just to see her covered in bird. <laughs> Actually, yes. By the time he gets up, you lift the hat off. And Nim is covered in anywhere from 20 to 30 patooies, all in various spots that do not manage to touch her skin, as well as even more surrounding the fire, pleasantly, like, huddling around it in warmth as they kind of just hover in circles. <laughs> Nim? Yes? Can we ever leave you alone? <laughs> I've never been left alone with this group. I don't know what you mean. She has a point. <laughs> you seem to get into trouble when left to your own devices. <laughs> the only trouble is I don't actually know how to stand up. I'm kind of covered in birds. <sighs> Let me try something. This one's name is Jerry, as Nim points to Jerry. <laughs> Jerry is indeed still sitting on your knee. A good little boy. Do yeah. we have any more of those berries left over from when uh, Hella went picking for food? I don't know. Do you? Can I check to see if we do? You can check to see if you do. Okay, what would I roll to check to see if we do? Uh, investigation, I guess. That sounds like oh, the most... Oh, goody! That sounds like the most uh, <laughs> close, normal one. Well, wouldn't it be based on how much we ate? Or how much he had used to cook? I, yeah, I would have thought so, but... Well, well, again, that's why I was asking you. I well, don't remember... Well, there might be since uh, Prin didn't need any. Well, yeah, but that's the stew. I think he's asking about the raw the unju- berries. Yeah, that would be up to you. How much did you use in the stew? I mean, I don't think I would have used all of them. All right, well, the stew. then I guess make an investigation check to see if any are left, because it's kind of like an up-to-fate thing. All right. Yeah, that's about right. Yeah, that that is indeed about right. Uh, you remember- Should I also roll? No. Uh, you remember using most of the berries, and you have, like, two left? Mm -hmm. Alright. Hmm. Well, I don't think I could use some food to get them off you. As two of the birds begin to make a little nest in each of Nim's buns. You know, if this were any other bird, I'd just leave it be. <laughs> Alright, let's see what I can That's do. still technically an option you can have on the table. It's just what leave Nim covered in poison birds until eventually they make their way onto some like actual skin they can poison. I, you never know. Nim asks, "Do you think if I asked politely, they'd move?" It's worth a shot. It's definitely worth a shot. 
<laughs> so Nim, <laughs> Nim asked, hey, can you guys be like a deer and move over so I can actually stand up? A cacophony of Twitch chatters and chirps fill the air. <laughs> oh god, they're Twitch chat. <laughs> As they proceed to continue to sit comfortably on and around you. Congratulations, you are the Disney princess of Zanzibar. Do I get any special traits from that title? <laughs> So, we're still on the road, right? Yeah, you're camped out in, like, the middle, of the, the, road? middle of the path, Man, yeah. Yeah, a bunch of jerks. Alright, so what I'm going to do... Um... Hmm. Ah. Hmm. Alright, so I want to take one of my... I'm pretty sure I also have torches. I think I'm going to take one of my torches. Mm-hmm. And I'm going to light it on the campfire. And I'm just going to get up and, like, walk around the birds slowly. Because I, I know they they seem to be very quick to, um... Spit. Yeah. Spit and I'm just going to make, like, a little hole in the dirt and just leave, like, the torch in the hole. And hopefully they'll just move over to that. So while Samson's doing that, Nim's talking to the birds, like, this is Samson. He looks like a criminal, but he's not. I've never seen him break the law before. I heard that. Were you not supposed to? How dare you say I'm not a criminal. You know what? That's fair. <laughs> <laughs> so, you stick the torch in the ground? Yes. Yeah, lit it on fire? Yes? Uh, yeah, so maybe, like, right around here. I don't see where here is. Ah, yes, there. Fair enough. Sorry, my roommate seated my help. No, that's fine. That's fine. No, uh, I'm surrounded by 30 birds. Uh, currently, oh. Nim is covered in patooies. Yeah. <laughs> that's great. So, as you stick the torch in the ground, uh... Some of the patooies on Nim were watching you, and they fly over and sit around by the torch. And then, um, I'm also going to leave. Um, I I'm gonna head back over here, and then I'm going to grab some- I'm going to grab the last two berries, and then I'm also going to, le like, leave it around the torch. You'd be like, come on, critters. The birds look at the berries, and one of them, like, pecks it, but it doesn't do anything more than kind of just, like, investigate what it is. No, I thought birds would have liked berries, but what do I know about birds? Yeah, they don't have birds in Varieses. <laughs> Not any of that you want to see, anyway. <laughs> Uh, so wait, how how many birds exactly are is, is is Nim covered in? Well, now twenty. There's ten by the torch, and I'd say there's <laughs> probably another like fifteen to twenty floating around the large campfire. You know what? While I'm gonna while I'm by that torch, I think I'm going to use that to light another one and then put it like right over here. Mm-hmm. Like set up a second torch. Alright. 
as you do that, uh, another couple of birds, like five off of Nim and five from the larger fire, go over and sit by that one. Alright. Making the very pleasant combination of chirps, chatters, and cheeps. What did you say, over there? Now, look right in this spot. What? Yablo. No, that's... Anyway, you could keep doing a thing while I draw that. Ah, oh, there you go. It. You got it. Yeah. Alright, and be like... Whew. There, maybe you can try to convince the rest of them to, uh head off towards those since they really seem to like rat things or warm things I'm not too sure Nim goes I can cast dancing lights and make like how many lights does it specify four done now yeah, four torch sized lights yeah <sighs> Oh, for whatever magic hoo-ha will get you out of this, cause, uh, I don't think it does us any good if you don't get any sleep. So, try dancing lights. Sorry, I was moving something on my computer, I didn't hear. He said, yeah, go for it. Okay. All right, a roomy. So, Nim turns to the birds and says, Wanna see a magic trick? The birds chirp and tweet. Alright, Nim gently casts dancing lights. And makes... Where's the draw tool? Here we go. A light here, a light here, and one right here, and there. <laughs> Actually, not that last one. I'll do it here instead. I just don't know how to get rid of them. Uh, try Control Z. Okay. No, you can no. just highlight it and delete it. Can you? Yeah, with the little mouse cursor thing. Oh! That you can. You can move them. Wow. <gasps> Alright. Okay. So, as you do that, all the birds on them and around the campfire, in fact, around the torches too, break up into dense spheres around the dancing lights and just kind of swarm around them. <laughs> These are terrifying. So wait, so they're no longer near the torches, right? They are not near, well, they're about as near to the torches as the dancing lights are. Um, so I guess they won't mind if I put the torches out and... Probably not. All right, so I'm gonna go snuff and recollect the torches. Did Fair Jerry enough. also leave? Jerry's somewhere in the mass. Depending uh, on your powers of Disney princess them, you'll probably be able to spot him. Uh, Jim's like that's a concentration spell. So once I go to sleep, <laughs> it also only lasts a minute. So. Well, you better get to sleep then, or you're gonna be covered in. Please. Whatever. All right. Uh, Remember, Nim. if you gotta go use the restroom, then by all means. I okay. Quite actually, this has never come up in a campaign I've done. I've only done one. <laughs> Is there a scale of how that's measured? Or you're like, I'm just going to the bathroom. <laughs> Do I have to roll to take a piss? You effect. You've rolled a ten. You beat your check. You effectively drain your bladder into your. 
Hell crit f- <laughs> crit <laughs> fail! Come up. You crit <laughs> fail using the bathroom and instead piss your pants! No. <laughs> I used to have a player who, who would insist on doing that and he gave himself a UTI. <laughs> oh. Okay, so first, because he was probably covered in poison, would prestidigitation clean that off? Um, but I actually have to wash these clothes. I think prestidigitation would be good. I mean, it doesn't eliminate dirt from the existence of reality, but it will push yeah. it off. Oh, it kind of like pushes it off. Yeah, so Nim cleans off, and then I guess Nim's gonna go to the bathroom. <laughs> All right, don't trip. Which one's the boys and which one's the girls? Uh, uh, Nim wouldn't ask. Sure. She was this already uh, told what to do. And it's used this one. Ah. Now, in the spot where Nim was, are there any, like, feathers on the ground? Damn. Mm. Mm. Roll investigation. They did flutter a lot. Oh, goody. I would actually like to roll before I go to the bathroom. <laughs> Man. Cause I I want feathers. Well, you're too it's late. In, it's my turn. It's investigation, right? Yeah. Or what? Are, it, <laughs> <good job. laughs> I don't good. think I've rolled a ten <laughs> over <laughs> any intelligence check with this character. I like so you got a done. critical the fail. <laughs> I got a bad twenty. So. Samson, for Samson whatever reason, yeah, yeah. Samson, much like previous characters, uh, can't see in the dark. Um, yeah. So Samson can't see anything, but Nim has supervision and sees a couple of. Nim needs supervision. <laughs> Nim sees a couple of feathers lying around her. Some by the campfire. She looks behind her and she sees that the balls are have a couple of feathers under them. All There's right. feathers. Nim also sees that more birds are now joining the ball party. <laughs> um so Nim will relay this to Samson and say we can deal with that in the morning. Or like she can uh, or, I'm trying to decide, do I want Nim to, like, just grow fur and pick them up and put them in her bag? Or... As I'm awake? Yeah, like, how... She could... She'd be like, this is all to herself. Watch this really cool trick. Ha ha ha! Technically is. That, that time yeah. you would be using all to herself. Yeah. And so, uh... Or you could just put on a decide. pair of gloves. <laughs> Does Nim have gloves? Is that just something people carry? Is a rich girl who doesn't have gloves? Yeah, she doesn't have, like, I those silk gloves. <laughs> Samson's got gloves. Oh, so then, uh, Nim goes, I see you're wearing gloves, and then she points out where the nearby <laughs> feathers are, and also tells them that they're sitting over them, on them <laughs> over there by the fires. Yeah, <laughs> nice try there, and then he, like... Wiggles, wiggles the fingers in his fingerless gloves. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, so then Nim, Man. yeah, then Nim's like, all right, she like, she always the only furry person she's ever seen, so she oh. just grows fur on her hands, and is like Samson. Look at Alter Self. I can grow fur. Yeah, and then she uh, wiggles her furry too. digits. And then I'm just gonna pull out some cloth that I bought from <laughs> the cabinet. <laughs> 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 and just offer like, like a, a, a like a large, like a decently large sliver of cloth to just wrap it in. Okay, so Nim takes that, and then she picks up the feathers. How many feathers does Nim pick up? Not the ones that the birds are sitting on. Like the ones by the fire and by you. Yeah. You. Uh. What would be a good skill for that? 
because I'm tired of the investigation checks. That doesn't I mean like if he, it, I mean I know where they are. I could sleight of hand to go pick them up. Yeah, go sleight of hand to pick them up. I'll give you something that's actually you know useful to your character. Sweet. Good enough. Yeah, you pick up four decently sized feathers. You don't really go for any of the small downy feathers or the tiny ones. I'll save them for later. All right, and now Nim goes to the bathroom as Nim, but a boy. So what? I'm assuming this is behind a bush, right? You just didn't yeah. dig a hole not oh, no, in front of a all bush. Behind bushes. <laughs> okay, so. Uh, I did not draw male Nim, but I can tell you what male Nim looks like. Still has <laughs> long hair. I mean, I kind of like how it I looks. I don't want to see male Nim in this context. <laughs> <laughs> also, aren't you going to the? Aren't you going I mean, to the women's bathroom? Well, yeah, yeah. but like, no, you okay, didn't have to so change no that one, much. No one. Yeah, no. To Nim was told. Nim at the door for this. <laughs> <laughs> Nim was told that you need to aim, and so Nim's like. Boys can aim. I'll you just don't turn to... into a boy. You don't okay. Need to change everything. Fair enough. I understand That's that there's not point. some kind of bodyguard bouncer owl bear being like boy or girl at the door. I just never thought that of uh, that all of the things of having a changeling player character in my campaign, I would be subjected to one of the points of interest being the character just growing a dick for the need of pissing. I did not think in my life that that sentence would have to come out of my mouth but i'm learning I mean, so many yeah, things about being a dm with shay. welcome to being a dm and playing with shay <laughs> i'm gonna grow a penis yeah so nim takes care of her business and then goes to bed drains the lizard as it were yeah. it's a turn okay, of phrase stop talking about this at any point I'm still reeling over the fact it became a point in the first place. Well, real quieter. No. Okay. I'll reel louder if you keep that up. All right. Nim tells Samson good night. All I know is that this is real weird. Good night. Yeah. I assume that uh. this was just like 20 minutes into Samson's shift. <laughs> yeah, pretty this, much. This whole, this whole catastrophe. <laughs> Honestly, could have been worse. Also, Dancing Lights probably ends as soon as Nim goes to sleep. Well, then, get rid of the lights. The birds watch the lights fade, and they look confused, but not agitated. And then they go back over to the campfire. <laughs> and they kind of just flock around the ground, making little I'm, chirping noises. I'm going to scoot away a bit from the... Um... Uh, campfire. Just because there's now, like, a lot of poisonous birds there. <laughs> and I feel like slightly moving away from it is a good idea. And then, um, uh, first things first, I'm going to reload my gun. <laughs> All three of them. Okay. So then I started blasting. <laughs> no, 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 no. This is just because I have the time. Oh, did you ever figure out whether or not your guns were canonically, like, magazine-fed, or if they were revolvers? They're they revolvers. were revolvers. Okay. I remember that was something that came up before. Classic six-shooters? Yeah. Well, what about the rifle? Um, it uses the same caliber. But, like, what's so the like, magazine? Is it six, or is it a ma- What's the- It's five. So it's a five so, barrel revolver. So it would, it would or, also, yeah, it'd also be a five barrel revolver. Chamber is what I meant to say. Chamber, rather. Yeah. But like, yeah, it'd also be a revolving one because that's like a nice stylistic cho choice. Yeah, it is. I'm actually surprised it's chambered in the same caliber and has one less chamber. But. Yeah, you know, Varetians. A Varetian. A more modern day Varetian rifle kind of started to lose the functionality. They didn't know how to make them guns good anymore. Anyway, so, go on. You, you have a now moderate-sized flock of tiny little chirping 
nightmares around your camp. I mean, they look cute as dickens. They are cute as dickens, and they are friendly. They are tweeting, they are chirping. You see some of them doing, like, little mating dances with each other. Whoa, I'm not gonna lie, it, it, it warms my heart just a bit <laughs> to see these little critters being cute. Every once in a while, one will you... come hopping up to you, just look at you, make some pleasant little tweets. <laughs> I'll, like, whistle back at it, but, like... At like a relatively like lower octave, so no one else, it doesn't wake up anyone else. So guns are reloaded, and now I wanna, um, while I have the light of the campfire, I kind of want to look <laughs> at the um, engravings on that shovel. All right, you can. That's the wrong colors. Right. I don't like that. I mean, like, if I'm just spending some time, like, you know, getting some dirt off it, just making sure I can, like, see it clearly in the light. Did I ever tell you what the initials were before? Like, did I come up with no. that or? Nope. You just said that they had initials on them, and I'm like, cool. I'll look at that later. Uh, then I am going, give me a second, because I want to get the appropriate colors for the birds. Appropriate. Yeah, that's enough to represent. Because there are still more of them, like, coming. Oh my god. <laughs> They're just forming a fucking colony around your campfire. But, okay, um. Pretty much. You see the initials, and you should write this down. JB carved into the handle. Alright, um. Is that for Joey Baxter? <laughs> I'll be honest, what I Ooh. thought of was Joseph Ballin. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Joseph Ballin! Ballin. I was talking about a Yu-Gi-Oh character and I'm surprised I remember his last name. You mean Joey Wheeler? No. I said the wrong show. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, you see the initials JB carved into the wooden handle. Ooh. I'd feel real bad if they were reversed. <laughs> um, sure. My brain's on it delay. I didn't get that until... <laughs> yeah. Like a whole 15 seconds later. <laughs> this is your brain on delay. But anyway, anything else? Um... Hmm. I mean, I got all that. Um... Hmm. I'm just going to like uh, so I'm gonna move right over here uh, right by Betel Geese and sort of just like start running my hand around the um, like around like the shell alright sort of giving it a feel it's certainly smooth and without any chips in it And, uh, you know, I'm gonna, like, knock on it, like, see how tough it is. No. And lick it. <laughs> it's quite hard, and you don't really hear anything. It's basically like you're knocking on solid rock, which is not very comfortable, of course, if you've ever done that. Yeah, no, but, like, I, I, I kind of get the idea. I just wanted to get an idea of, like, what this thing... I wanted Samson to get an idea of what this thing feels like. Fair enough. But the outside it feels is... feels like a shell. Are you looking at it in the light? I mean, like... I mean, like, the light's here, and the shell's right here. So, like, I'm looking at what I can, because I can't see in the dark. <laughs> oh, yeah, apparently. As well, you look... Apparently, I don't have dark vision. Fair enough, but, like, even people have some amount of night vision. 
Oh yeah, yeah but, but things like, start to go gray the further back it is. Yeah, but like there, I I assume like I assume like this fifteen feet is like dim light, and then further than that, it it I mean this fifteen feet is bright light. Further than that is like dim light, and the rest of it is just darkness. Fair enough, I see where you're coming from. But you look at the shell and. It's smooth, it's very hard, it's almost cool to the touch, because it's very stone-like. But probably most importantly is in the light, it does shine like the night sky itself. Hmm. <laughs> I'm just gonna have like this big old smirk on my face, just like, man, I can't wait to get something done with you. It's gonna be fun. And then I guess I'll just, um... Slump back down... Like... Around here. I'm gonna, like, lay... I'm gonna, like, take off my, uh, cloak. And just sort of, like, lay it down on the floor. Alright. And then I'm just gonna, like, use that as, like, a little workstation to just clean my guns out. You know, maintenance them. Maintenance them. Fair guns, enough. Guns, knives, short sword, anything, really. As you're doing this, you see multiple birds doing little derpy parakeet walks up and up to and looking at what you're doing. Very inquisitive, inquisitive little creatures. Samson gun guys. goes off and he accidentally shoots one in the face. And no, they all no, spit no, on they're him. all unloaded. You don't clean a loaded gun. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, you just say you reloaded them. <laughs> well, yeah, but like, he can easily just take them out. He reloaded them and then he unloaded them. Yeah. And then he's gonna reload them. <laughs> yeah. Well, no. I just, I just meant the whole loading thing because I wanted to just keep track of everything mechanically. Yeah. And also... I'm loading every gun. Yeah, so you're cleaning them out and then loading them up. Yeah. So yeah, just doing like little maintenance on my stuff without like letting the dirt get to it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's about it. Um. After like all of these little rituals are um, said and done, how much time is it till like I gotta wake up Celeste? <laughs> It's getting close to that time. Time's passing. The flock is growing. In fact, when huh. some of them do that little half sphere around the bonfire, almost all the light is obscured by their little bodies. Mm -hmm. It's like a little carpet of birds. Don't mind the chair. The chair's broken. I'm minding it. Well, then, out with you. Um, so that's all said and done. Um, or in other words, then leave. <laughs> I thought you were going to post Hiala's face. Because it's a <laughs> emote now. Alright, um, with the small amount of light I can, like I have, is there any way I can scrounge up, like, a few more twigs and, like, pine cones and branches and stuff to make a second fire yeah sure you could do that all right um, of course do that it's a goal. I mean one more birds means more feathers and two less birds in one place will probably be a lot more helpful hmm. So yeah, I'll 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 do all that and I'll fashion together a second bonfire. Yeah. And then back back up. <laughs> <laughs> So you make a second bonfire, and some of the birds leave the first one, but new visitors also arrive at the other fire. 
just to get a number, how many birds are there right now? Oh, there's easily like a hundred at this point. They're small, they're tiny. There might even be more than a hundred. <laughs> like imagine something the size of a finch. Oh, finches are so cute. Easily could fit on your finger. You these you just don't want on your finger. They can make a nice slider sandwich if they weren't poisonous that is uh, yeah i mean i guess it would be great for a last meal a little extra spice on it yeah a little extra it's like drinking bleach it's the most wonderful spice mm, bleach. the forbidden spice <laughs> all right so no nah, that's tide like, pods i'm just gonna like lean back over this way and just that's sort of um handy. Just sort of like wait out the rest of my time till till, till I gotta wake up Celeste and <laughs> give her the rundown on what Nim did. Well, I'm she not technically get up on her own since it's been four hours. Yeah, I don't I'm not getting that. up until he tells me. <laughs> yeah, she may not need the sleep, but she, she is an ornery young miss. Uh, she don't do nothing unless asked. Uh. Um. By the way, Nim, did you come? Like, lay down next to me? Is that what I'm getting? Yeah. Alright, well then I'm gonna use Molder to make you a bed, too. Oh, thank you. But you're still... You're meditating! Hey. I could wake up in between. <laughs> no wonder why you got bags under your eyes. I can't, sl I can't sleep anyways. I'm not worried about it. Alright, so... Once the time comes by, I'll, I'll go up Celeste. Celeste. I, I, I immediately turn and just like stare at you. Yes, it is time. Mm -hmm. Also, okay. uh, be careful. Um, yeah, if this was less dire, I'd just let you find out by yourself. Uh, <laughs> there's like a small army of those little poison birds flocking around both fires. What do our what do you mean, army? Are we fighting? No, no, no. Hopefully not. I think we would lose. <laughs> but I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna like slowly get up out of the bed and peek over the owl bears, and like just see the horde of birds. And I'll slowly turn back to Samson. Why? I, I'm just gonna like point over to the bed that has him in it and be like, praying say it. She's a. Uh... She seems to be quite the, uh, bowel friend. Bowel? Fowl! Oh, uh, okay, I was like, what? <laughs> no, do not, do not insult her as such, but yes, it was a foolish move. <laughs> she got uh, feathers, though. I don't think that's much of an insult. Anyway. I, I don't mean, get the joke. It, the bowel. No, I get the, the joke, I get the joke, but she doesn't. No, that's why I'm saying it in person, in character. Oh. Fowl on top of bird. So fowls are bird, and she befriended them. That's These a fowl called... friend. These are called fowls. I think I don't know. You're supposed to know more about things that, than I am. I do not speak this language. There's... And I'm just gonna like stare at. <laughs> Doing. <laughs> uh... Anyway. Yes. Lots of poison birds. Yes. I think we all learned our lesson. Don't freak them out. Uh, they really seem to like bright things. So I made a second fire. I guess oh. just the... Uh, like, so I'm assuming you attracted more of them. I may have, but... I see I see the, the rectangles getting bigger. <laughs> listen. Poor I couldn't, put, I couldn't put out the fire. So I figured if I try to move them away from one fire, and I did, it's just that we got more of them. Listen, I'm not here to argue. I'm tired. Yes, you go to sleep. All right. And I can will... I use this bed? I, I think about it for a long time. <laughs> Fine. Nice. Celeste is like, do I get petty revenge for the gambling incident or no? That and the birds. <laughs> um, Remember, you might want to like put them out by sunrise. That way, they, you know, 
aren't just here the whole time when the owl bears wake up. You Could just... expect me to chase off all of these birds by myself. Uh, no, I'm so... sure once the fire's out, they'll go by the by themselves. And if not, just wake up a uh, yala.